Division One, and the headline here is all eyes on Region Four. Region 1 through 3, we're going to talk about you in a second, but we need to talk about Region 4 and how that is an absolute battle royal yep. that is going to be, uh, every week it's going to be something big, okay? Every week there's a game you can't miss, okay? Holland and Sabinal in the first week, yep. okay? There's that. Then we're probably getting Mason and Shiner. Okay, Mason's a favorite in that one, yep. but we're probably getting that. Let's say Mason gets past it, then you get to you get to draw Thrall. Yeah. Okay, Thrall's playing really good, and nobody's paying attention to it. And then I think we're getting Mason and and Refuria. And if you want to look me in the eye and say that those are the two best teams in this bracket, it's a reasonable argument. Hard to argue. They've been. They're really been good. Really good. If yeah. you want to say that Mason and Shiner are, the, or I'm sorry, Mason and Refuria are the two best teams in that region. I believe it. Yep. I could believe it. Now, it's not. That's not to say it's a cakewalk. Okay, Region One is, I think, wide open, and there's a lot of teams here that I think people don't know about. Right. Stratford's been great. They've been really good. Their one losses to Canadian, who yep. is a really good and b bigger than they yep. are. McCamey's been great. Yep. Abernathy's been great. I think the winner of Stanet in West Texas and Sundown yeah. could get there. I think I still believe in New Deal. Yeah. I think Holly's interesting yeah. now they got Quay Stokes back. Yeah. Stanford's playing with house money after we picked them to finish last in their district. Yeah. And all they've done is just win the district absolutely. And, and absolutely go just on a, an it's unbelievable a, it's, tear. It's a deep, deep, deep region there. Yeah. Region two, I think I think we I think we have a pretty good feel for it. Yeah. I think it's probably whoever wins at Mart Daly on regional semifinal. Yeah. Probably what we're looking at. Yeah. Region three. Again, a- another team that is just in a part of the state because it's way out in the piney woods. <laughs> yeah. But San Augustine is hammering people. Yeah. And they're doing it with defense. Yeah. And I think San Augustine might have their best team in years. In years. Yeah. But let's be real. The intrigue for me lies in region four. The most intrigue. Yeah. The three contenders, Mason and Refurio, again, is flip a coin, and it's it's who it's well, like I, I if you want if you want to say you're absolutely certain that Refurio is going to beat Mason, cool. If you want to say you're absolutely certain of the inverse, agree. Like I yes, I agree with both of you. It's a football fan stream. I mean, these are great programs, great coaches, great traditions. It's and and they've been on this collision course for a few years now, and it's it's always fun. The other one here is Mart, and they started the year. They they have one loss to Lexington, who's a three A team and an undefeated one at yeah. that. Mart has done everything you could possibly ask of them. If you want to say they're the most talented, I believe it. Yep. Like they are really really. Talented. I have seen them in person. I have never seen a collection of skill players in two A D one that is that fast, is that athletic, is that big. And I saw Canadian a couple years ago. Mm-hmm. Now. Canadian overall, I think, was a better team than this Mart team is now, but that doesn't mean Mart isn't a state champion contender. Absolutely. The sleeper here is De Leon. And you know, you know how I am. This was this was a train that I hopped on board early in the year. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And it's paid off yep. to this point. So far. If they if they get a shot at Mart, that's gonna tell the tale. That's what will ultimately define the season is whether or not they can beat Mart in what would be a regional semifinal. Yeah. That's my Paul Roberts. Interview. Whose yes. football opinions we can trust Ta-da. Mm-hmm. says Stratford is the team in Region One. I agree. He, he says they're on a roll. I, agree. I believe him. I agree with Stratford. I agree with Stratford, but I also think that there are so many teams there that I think it's gonna be tough for all of them. Yeah, you and can't afford to slip. For me, Absolutely, is, is, is totally where I'm agree. At. 